If you've updated to the new iOS 26 beta and you're not loving it, maybe it's the design changes, maybe it's the bugs. Don't worry, you're not stuck. In this video, I'll show you two easy ways to roll back to iOS 18 and get that classic Apple experience back. No matter which method you choose, back up your iPhone first. Method 1. Easiest way. One-click downgrade with iFixer. This is perfect for beginners or anyone who wants a quick downgrade. Download iFixer to your computer using the link in the description. Connect your iPhone with a USB cable. Click Enter Recovery Mode. No need to mess with button combos. Choose iOS Upgrade, Downgrade, Downgrade iOS. iFixer will detect the iOS 18 firmware automatically. Just click to download. Once downloaded, click Start to Downgrade. In a few minutes, your iPhone will be back on iOS 18. Smooth and easy. During setup, you can restore your data from iTunes or iCloud Backup. Method 2. Manual Downgrade via iTunes. Note, this method only works if you're still on the beta version. Now put your iPhone in recovery mode manually by quickly pressing the volume up and down buttons and then long press the power button. Don't let go when the Apple logo appears until the recovery mode screen appears. Of course, you can also use iFixer to put your iPhone in recovery mode with one click. Open iTunes or Finder on your PC. You'll see a pop-up. A click Restore, then Restore and Update. Now, wait for iTunes to download iOS 18 and then install it for you. Patient, it will take longer. The easier and more convenient way to downgrade iOS is still iFixer. Get the download link below the video. Remember to subscribe to our channel if it helped you.